No action. Are we doing Joanne first? Yeah, we're going to go ahead and read through Joanne. Go ahead. Joanne. All right. <coughs> It is moved the Board of Commissioners agrees to accept the proposal of the GBPD group to enter into an agreement providing design and plant preparation services for Brimfield Township project known as Howie Road Culvert Replacement. Second. Roll call. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Brina. Yes. It's moved the Board of Commissioners agrees to enter to, into a septic assistance program agreed upon between Portage County Board of Commissioners and Portage County Regional Planning Commission and the CF Clement excavating for a septic system replacement. Second. A roll call. Tony. Yes. Speaking. Yes. Sabrina. Yes. It's moved Board of Commissioners agrees to enter into a septic assistance program agreement between Portage County Board of Commissioners and Portage County Regional Planning Commission and George Gibson excavate, excavating the septic system replacement. Second. Roll call. <clears throat> Tony. Yes. Speaking. Yes. Sabrina. Yes. Smooth Board of Commissioners agrees to enter into a letter of arrangement between Portage County and the Auditor of the State of Audit to audit the financial statements as of and for the year ending in December 31st, 2020. Second. A roll call. Tony. Yes. Vicky. Yes. Sabrina. Yes. Let's move the Board of Commissioners agrees to enter into an amendment number seven between the Board of Commissioners and the Correctional Correctional Health Healthcare Company LLC. For inmate health care services. Second. Roll call. County. Yes. Vicky. Yes. Sabrina. Yes. Since move the Board of Commissioners agrees <laughs> to enter into an agreement between Portage County Board of Commissioners on behalf of the Portage County, County Jobs and Family Services and Portage County Sheriff's Department. Second. A roll call. County. Yes. Vicky. Yes. Sabrina. Yes. It's moved the Board of Commissioners agrees to enter into a cleaning service agreement between the Board of Commissioners on behalf of the Portage County Sheriff and the Langston Ultimate Claiming Services, Inc. Second. Okay, roll call. Tony? Yes. Vicky? Yes. Sabrina? Yes. It's moved the Board of Commissioners agrees to enter into an agreement between the Board of Commissioners on behalf of Portage County Sheriff and Lexington. Second. Okay. Roll call. Tony? Yes. Vicky? Yes. Sabrina? Yes. Second. Okay, roll call. Tony? Yes. Vicky? Yes. Sabrina? Yes. Okay, do we have time? You receive the email with the figures? Yes. Okay, uh, we don't need number two again. We are checking on that. Um, Wait. Been removed for three weeks in a row? Yeah, that's concerning somewhat, but we're, we're following up to figure out why. I was just going to ask. Whether that's okay. <laughs> but it is what it is at this point. Um, the the uh, then and nows, there continue to be a few from November. Um, and December that by this time we would hope would be cleared up. However, uh, the auditor's office did change how contracts and POs are encumbered this year, and it did take a little bit longer. So um, while normally I would suggest we need to start maybe looking at some of these departments at this point to see why they haven't gotten everything processed through that may be playing a role, so um, I'll wait a couple weeks here uh, before we get overly concerned regarding the then and nows, but they do remain higher than what we would normally Do you know why it would we be. changed, Todd? I mean, is there something that... I, well, there's some... Um, I'll say some departments um, who were not necessarily handling the year-end carryovers, and that was causing issues with some of our reporting. We were actually under-reporting what we really had due. Um, and so it was in response to that to try and get those figures to be more reliable at the end of the year without having to go okay. and ask individual people. The more we can automate that, the easier it is for them to generate their reports and whatnot. That was the impetus for a lot of it. Okay. So next year, it'll or this year, will be wind its way through the system, and then hopefully next year we'll have, we'll be able to start clean slate and everybody will be knowing what's going All right. on. 
The Board of Commissioners agrees to approve the Thursday, March 4, 2020, bills HC, HCX, HCH payments and pre presented by the County Auditor, reviewed by the Department of Budget and Financial Management. 2021. 2021. You know what, just a second. I did not get the bill, Ryan, in my email. Did you guys get I, it? I, I believe I did. I didn't. Did you? No. I got it. So Were the commissioners on it? Yeah, because <laughs> I, I've been scrolling my thing and I'm thinking, did I overlook it? But I didn't get it. Do you want me to go print three times yeah, real quick? Yeah, I just like Let to me, I'll print it. it, I'll print it. Before I approve it. Okay. That's what I was just talking about. There are, it is higher than I would normally like this time of year, but that's the whole issue of that's it did take people longer to get their about, purchase yeah. orders in, which is why we may have more than the than yeah, we should normally Yeah, you said something last week that I just wanted to, yeah. like I said, I, I probably didn't hear it because I was looking, because I'm thinking I couldn't find yeah. a bill run in my, my email. Yeah, like I said, we're going to leave it a week or two more. Yeah, I think um, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah, because I think it's going to be a little bit longer than that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's what I'm to let that issue wind its way through. And do we know why we're, we're not having um, the transfer of the health benefits? I mean, this is like week three. Well, we were waiting on signatures, um, and I, I just called Julianne um, to double check. All those are in. She believes everything's ready to go. I need to check with Susan next. Okay. Um, if signature we don't have one next week, I'll have a better signature. explanation for you. My guess is next week we will have payments. Whose signatures are we waiting on? Susan and Joanne? Or? You don't know? The prosecutor. Okay. I, mean, okay. they, you know, I know they Susan's all go. had a terrible time this year, so I, yeah. I, I get it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, like I said, if, if we don't have a payout for you next week, I will have better explanations as to what we're waiting on. Thank you. Does anyone have any other questions? Otherwise, we'll go ahead and let him start reading. That's the only ones I had. This bill of the Board of Commissioners agrees to approve the Thursday, March 4th, 2021 journal vouchers as presented by the County Auditor and reviewed by the Department of Budget and Financial Management. Second. A roll call. Is that Jeremy Andrews? Yes. Did we vote on the bill? Yeah, I don't think we ever voted on the bill. I had a motion. What did we what we, we have a motion? We didn't do number one. Yeah, oh, we got to start from there because I, I that's what I, I thought said. we did I that one. Get it. So I marked that we did it. I marked we did it too. It was moved, but I don't know if it was second. Second. Oh, roll call. Roll call. Amy. Uh, Tony. Yes. Vicky. Yes. Sabrina. Yes. That's for the bills, right? Yes. 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 Okay, now we go to three. Yes. This bill, the board of commissioners agrees to approve the third, the Thursday, March fourth, two thousand twenty-one journal vouchers. As presented by the county auditor, reviewed by the Department of Budget and Financial Management. Second. A roll call. Tony. Yes. Vicky. Yes. Sabrina. Yes. It's moved. Board of Commissioners agrees to approve the Thursday, March fourth, two thousand twenty-one. Then and now certification, as presented by the county auditor re and reviewed by the Department of Budget and Financial Management. Second. A roll call. Tony. Yes. Vicky. Yes. Sabrina. Yes. Number five is just moving gas tax for a project fund okay. that's that's eligible for that. Let's okay. move the Board of Commissioners agrees to transfer $6,818 from Fund 1201 Motor Vehicle Gas Tax to Fund 4247 Lakewood Road, Monroe, Monroe, Monroe Road Resurfacing. Second. Hey, roll call. Tony? Yes. Vicki? Yes. Sabrina? Yes. Uh, Number six is um, 
and I don't know if John Vance talked, it was, it should have been on their agenda, but at first we didn't think they had items, so they threw it onto mine because it came in a little late. This is establishing the surcharge for the Man Away yeah. residents per the agreement that you've previously approved. Um, this would add $64.56 a month, a month to those people who uh, have both <coughs> services. Um, the, that is the amount per the agreement. Um, and then the idea is that in November, December, you will review that uh, for possible change. It's moved the Board of Commissioners agrees to set the initial surcharge rate for the village of Manway Sewer and Water customers establishing, established in the transfer agreement between Port Town Board of Commissioners and the village of Manway. Second. Okay, roll call. Yes. Yes. Sabrina? Yes. Of course, the journal entry is our standard monthly entry um, as recommended by the state auditors. These are either in line with your policies or if they weren't, you also did separate journal entries on these. It's moved the Board of Commissioners approve the February 2021 adjustment to the Portage County Water and Portage County Sewer and Streetsboro Sewer billing accounts reported on the adjustment reports submitted and reviewed by the Department of Budget and Financial Management. Second. Okay, roll call. Tony? Yes. Vicki? Yes. Brina? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Tom. Yeah, if we get, we're in recess for five minutes. Yep, until 10, until, until 10. they uh, share a few to speak.